Hello Lilies and Lost Boys. I wanted to sit down and make an update video for you guys. That's face cam and my dog just walked into the room. Awesome. As you may have noticed, I haven't been uploading gaming videos in a while. I announced a few, well about, it's been a month and a half ago that my husband and I gave birth to our baby girl, Evelyn. Uh, she's seven weeks old and she has brought so much joy to our life. However, with that joy means all of my attention has been put onto her. So my life has changed a lot and for the better. I'm now a stay at home mom. My main goal every single day is to take care of her, to feed her and make sure that she's growing well. And then at some point, take a shower <laughs> in that, in there. <laughs> and I feel like, and I don't know, I just felt like I needed to come and sit down and talk to you guys about how I'm feeling about my gaming channel and just my feelings in general towards YouTube because I'm feeling very discontent. If you guys didn't know, my husband and I have a vlog channel and I, we're active on there. We've actually been uploading vlogs and videos, three videos a week for like the past two or three weeks. I'll link our vlog channel down below. Definitely go check it out if you wanna see more in depth of my life, my husband's life, our baby's life, if you wanna watch her grow, we're documenting that. And at first I thought I was just having like this discontentment with YouTube in general, but then I realized like, no, that's not it because I'm still like passionate about recording vlogs and passionate about uploading those and, doing like topical videos. Why am I in such a rut when it comes to this channel right here? And I don't really have a straight answer for you guys. Like I wish I did. I, I've been inconsistent with this channel now for about a year. Uh, maybe even more than that. Like I start a series, I get a few episodes in and then it's just like, I quit and I don't know what it is. Like I start off really strong with a series and I'm super excited to start it and I love it. And then I just feel like it doesn't fit me anymore. I'm just uninterested. It's not fun for me to play or I start comparing myself to other YouTubers who are doing the same games and seeing the feedback they're getting compared to the feedback that I'm getting. And it's just this huge ball of like chaos. <laughs> so I've been doing some soul searching when it comes to this gaming channel in the past month and a half because right now my heart is my baby. Like she is everything to me. My husband is everything to me. My dog's everything to me. I'm gonna cry because I'm freaking going through postpartum hormones. Anyone else out there who has experienced them, they know what I'm talking about. And I think that's why my vlog channel comes so easily is because I'm documenting what I love. And to be honest, vlogging is just easier too because it's like two or three minute clips throughout the day. So if baby's crying or needing fed and she's doing that for two or three hours at a time, like I can, be with her and take care of that need. Whereas if I'm recording a gaming video, it may take me an hour or two to record the video in itself. And then it takes me maybe two hours to edit the video and then I have to upload it. So gaming just requires a lot more time up front. Whereas with my vlog channel, our vlogs are about 20 minutes long. So you're only seeing 20 minutes out of our 24 hour day. So a lot can happen in those 24 hours. And then it takes me about, depends if she's sleeping, it only takes me about 30 to 45 minutes to edit the vlogs. Cause we're not pros and we don't do anything like fancy editing wise with those. We just chop it up, throw some music in there and it's good to go. So I've been talking to Tyler, my husband about like what I should do about this channel because I've considered quitting <laughs> and I hate saying that because I don't want you guys to think like I'm just an overall quitter because I'm more of the type that I just want to do what I love and what I'm passionate about. And if it means that I'm abandoning something that doesn't hold value in my life anymore, then I am. And I really had to sit there and think like, is my gaming channel bringing value to me as a person and to my life? <sighs> I'm still struggling answering that. Like I wish I had a clear answer because at times, yes. And like certain ways that I use this channel, yes. But then there's also times when I can definitely answer no. Something I've really been enjoying doing lately on my gaming channel or just in general is live streams because for those, it doesn't require me to edit. I literally just jump on a video game and I stream it for an hour or two hours and I can do that in the evening whenever Tyler's home from work and he can take care of Evelyn and it's just kind of like some me time. I love that. But I did a poll a while back and asked you guys, what do you prefer, uh, recorded and edited videos or do you prefer live streams? And a lot of you guys said, actually the majority of you said, you like recorded 
videos and I'm scared I can't produce the content that you guys are wanting to see. And honestly, I've been feeling like that for a while. I've been noticing in the comment sections on any of my videos, it's mostly viewers asking to see a different series or asking me whenever something else is gonna come back or just tell me I'm playing a game wrong. And it's just not enjoyable for me as a content creator to sit and read those comments. I sound like I'm just sitting here complaining and I'm sorry, but this is, I'm literally just like vomiting what I've been thinking and feeling for the past year and hoping you guys accept it. <laughs> but it really is discouraging as a YouTuber to, to create content that you love and then see that video get not nearly as many views as my like Harmony Hollow videos get. And I love Harmony Hollow, don't, don't get me wrong. Like Harmony Hollow is bae, it is great. Like my Sims videos, I started out as a simmer guys. Like that's the content that I love to create was simming videos. It was my favorite. I love the Sims, I always will. It has such a near and dear place in my heart, but those videos are just something you guys are interested in. Or maybe I haven't found that niche and found those viewers who want to watch those videos yet. And that's just a whole other story, but I don't know if I want to put time into it at this point in my channel's growth at almost 12,000 subscribers to try to bring up a series that is only going to get 50 views whenever I have other videos that get over a thousand views. So do you see my point? Maybe a little bit. Oh, baby's starting to cry. So we do not have long. Anyway, what that means with this channel is I don't know what's gonna happen. Um, I really think I'm gonna attempt to figure something out because I don't wanna quit gaming altogether. I love it. I just need to figure out something that's gonna work. And who knows, maybe I'll figure that out once my baby's a little older and I can have more of a schedule and more of a routine. Right now my routine is taking care of her when she cries. I'm literally like, cash cow. She calls me and I'm coming. And maybe once that happens, I'll be more successful. I shouldn't say successful, but I'll feel more successful. Like I can take charge of my day. However, when I don't have my husband at home with me to help out, like I, I can't be a thousand places at once. And my gaming channel is a place that I can't be all at once. With that being said, <laughs> what you can expect from me right now is live streams. That's what I can commit to. Maybe at some point I'll start uploading videos again that are like recorded and edited and the style that you guys like to see. But right now, live streams is what I can handle. I've been live streaming on Twitch because if you guys don't want to see live streams here, then I figured maybe I just go live stream on Twitch, which I'll link my Twitch down below. You guys, you always say like, oh, I don't have a Twitch. I can't blah, blah, blah. You don't have to have a Twitch account to watch. You can still watch, you just can't comment. And creating a Twitch account is literally the same as creating a YouTube account. Like it's. You can use the same email and password and everything guys, fairly easy. <laughs> or I may go back to just streaming on YouTube again. So I really like that. And you guys seem to enjoy it. The ones who do show up to streams. And if that's not the content you want to watch, then I give you 100% like the okay to unsubscribe. Like you do not have to say subscribe to me if it's not content you're enjoying because I don't want to waste your time either. So I'm at this bridge where I don't want to waste my time and I want to do what I love, but I'm also not going to expect you guys to watch something that you don't love. Take that as you will. Like I said, right now, my passion is my vlog channel. That's what I'm putting a lot of effort into, a lot of my time into. It's what I love doing. My husband and I, really just feel like that comes natural for us. And we're probably gonna look back on our vlogs like three or four years from now and realize this was not natural. But it, you know what? It's memories, we're making memories. I feel like I've rambled enough. I hope I somewhat got across what has been on my mind. I love you all so much. And I know we've grown a lot in the past few months, which is crazy to me because I haven't been uploading. So thank you guys if you're new and you subscribe, thank you. I'm sorry, this is not my best self. You're not seeing the best of me. I'm just sorry. <laughs> I'm a new mom, I'm sorry. <laughs> like I said, all of my social media will be linked down below, my vlog channel, my Twitch, my Instagram, Twitter. There's different ways to be involved and interact with me other than just this gaming channel right here. So if that's something you're interested in, definitely go check those out. I love you all. If you have yet to subscribe, Feel free to do so, but don't expect a ton from me. I love you all. Bye.